But when you look at Alabama's SEC record, you see two impressive wins and then two wins where Alabama barely got by. The two impressive wins against Georgia and Arkansas both came on the road. And the two wins against Kentucky and Ole Miss where Alabama won both of those games by only three points came right behind me in the friendly confines of Bryant-Denny Stadium. I asked Coach Saban and the players about the difference between playing home and away. There really aren't any differences until you come to Friday and you got to decide whether you're going to walk across the street and stay in this hotel or get an airplane and fly wherever you're going. But other than that, I don't, I don't really know of any other than, you know, sometimes you do things for crowd noise, which, you know, certainly could be an issue in this game. And we usually don't address that till Thursday. So other than those two factors, you know, I'm not sure. Uh, that there's anything different. We just when we travel, when we play home, we play the same. We just we just need to execute better. That's about it. It won't be no different. Uh, uh, Georgia, it, that's, that wasn't a big stadium, but I mean, for what was going on and what was happening, that blackout thing, and the, you know, the crowd was very loud. It can you can kind of compare it to Georgia, you know, Tennessee. So I think you can say we've been in this type of situation before. You know what I mean? And it won't. I mean, it won't affect us at all. It's an external factor. Well, Alabama fans hope that the Crimson Tide can continue that trend of playing well on the road as Alabama travels to Knoxville to play the Tennessee Volunteers on Saturday. I'm Brent Magnuson for Palestra.net, the College Network.